Hey everyone, I'm a baby. <laughs> it's so great to be here doing stand up. It's my first time, so please be gentle. Like my shampoo. <laughs> I'm actually too young to stand up, so I'm more of a laid down comedian. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a nocturnal being. I tend to sleep during the day, but at nighttime, I'm ready to potty. I use my feet to kick things off until mom is tossing and turning in bed. <laughs> I'm so ready for real life potties. I hear even the adults like to bring pacifiers. <laughs> I'm a little too young for ecstasy but I admit that I can't get enough of that folic acid. <laughs> I've been trying to watch my weight while in the womb, but it's been difficult. My parents recently bought 12 pints of ice cream and 50 New York bagels off the internet. True story. <laughs> my mom's birth canal is going to be more like a birth river when I'm done with it, if you know what I mean. Oh my god. <laughs> the recent situation in the Suez Canal has given me ideas for the birthing process. <laughs> this guy knows what I'm talking about. I'm both excited and nervous to be born. Just think about all those new experiences. Being hungry, having a dirty diaper, wearing clothes, bathing. Right now, I don't have to do anything, and everything I need comes to me through a cord. I like to call it womb service. <laughs> <laughs> I was talking to some twins the other day, and now I feel a little more fortunate. At least I don't have to have a womb mate. Oh. <laughs> Sometimes I wish I was a test tube baby then at least I'd have a womb with a view. <laughs> I haven't actually met my parents yet, but if you'd ask me today what I think of them, I'd say that my mom is excellent, and my dad oh. is semen better every day. <laughs> <laughs> my mom's originally from Appalachia, so she identifies as white trash. That's why she has been having Braxton Hicks contractions. <laughs> you ever notice how some babies are like, wah, 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 and others are like, goo goo gaga? What's the deal with that? <laughs> I hear a lot of comedians making jokes about Lyft and Uber. Those platforms aren't for me. Mommy and Me is the best rideshare service. <laughs> it has a much more forgiving vomit policy. Every <laughs> ride comes with a burp cloth. You can rate Mommy with one to five kicks. <laughs> My most frequent ride request is the trip to and from the bathroom. There's a lot of debate between parents about the benefits of nursing over bottle feeding, but no one has thought to ask a baby directly. I'm a fan of the Little Caesars nursing policy. I'll take whatever is hot and ready. <laughs> I'll be coming out into the world soon, so I've been practicing some pickup lines. Like, Mom, my feet hurt. I really don't feel like walking. Hey, girl, can you help me up and do my stroller? Okay, okay. Those weren't actual pickup lines. How about this? Girl, you take my breath away. At least, I assume you would. I've never taken a breath yet. <laughs> if I told you you had a beautiful body... Would you breastfeed me? <laughs> Did it hurt when you gave birth to me? <laughs> Did you know that all pregnant women are superheroes? One common pregnancy symptom is called 
lightning crotch. To cure lightning crotch, expecting moms can install a conductive metal rod in their downstairs area. Some of my toys were taken from other kids and given to me by their parents. I can't shake the feeling that I'm robbing the cradle. At this point, though, I think I have a shot at displaying my collection on MTV Cribs. <laughs> One of my favorite pieces is a doll named Candace. That's right, I'm such a sleazebag, I even took candy from a baby. <laughs> <laughs> the first thing I'm going to do after being born is cut the cord. <laughs> I'm going to be a wireless baby, baby. <laughs> the hospital where I'll be born practices delayed cord clamping, though. That means Comcast is still going to bill me like 50 bucks. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you've been great. I'm a baby. I'll be here all trimester. Yeah. <laughs> wow. <laughs>